Good morning. It's getting 30. It's, it's actually 10.30. It's actually 10.25. Today we're in St. Thomas, and I think we're all set to go. We got everything? Yes, we're not taking any swimming trunks or nothing, right? Mm -mm. Today we're going to be shopping because I read that it was like the place to shop in the Caribbean. So that's where we're going. We're going to buy Mother's Day gifts because we told Yay. our mamas. We got to spend more money. Oh, shut up. We told us spending money. What? We told our mamas we would bring them something back for Mother's Day. So we got to do some looking around to find some stuff. We don't even know what we want to get. We're just going to let the Caribbean lead us. Right here. Tomorrow, we will, tomorrow we'll be in St. Martin, which is where we're going to lay out on the beach. There's a certain beach I have to... I have to... Huh? Okay. I have to... I can't really remember exactly what it was called, but tomorrow I'll tell you we get to take a water taxi over to the beach. So but tomorrow will be our beach day and maybe a little bit of shopping tomorrow. Because there's like a French place that they have all these like high end fancy stores and I wanna go look in those. Maybe find some macarons. Yeah. Hopefully so. So now we're going to breakfast. Welcome to St. Thomas. We're still walking to breakfast, but look at this water. That will take us downtown, which is where all the shopping takes place. We're in Charlotte to Motley, however you pronounce that, I don't know. We are in downtown and there's some random chickens. <laughs> Photographer here. He's taking pictures of chickens. Okay. <laughs> They're eating rice. Hello, little guy. Where'd you go? Know how happy I am right now. We just walked. How far? In the rain. Thankfully, Daddy got Cody an umbrella for his birthday. That shout, sucker. Shout out to Pops. Shout out. You saved us today, cause I should I could have melted. Oh my God. Sugar melts. We know this. So we're at Yacht Haven Grand. We tried downtown, but it was just like any other little. Oh, it feels so good. We're about to burn slam up. So. This is the fancy place, and we're supposed to be near some mega million dollar yachts over here. Well, guys, we are still in St. Thomas. We're, it's been raining. It's been raining off and, and all. As you can see off the ground. So we keep having to find shelter, but in the process, we're learning things and making friends, local friends. Locals. So. Which are from the states. Well, one of. Two of most them. Most of them. Most of them have been from the states, but we've learned that they were hit by Irma and Maria, and back yeah, back to back. That wasn't. They haven't even. They haven't even finished rebuilding. They're still from when they got with, hit. They're rooftops, and their hurricane season starts in June. June, and a lot of people still have tarps on their roofs. It just makes us realize how blessed we are, because it was so crazy thinking like back when we got hit by Matthew, thinking our world had ended. And it, our house wasn't even damaged or nothing, but it was just so, it's like so tragic. Should we go through here? Yeah. 
it was so crazy thinking about all of that and these people they were without water and power for how long five months she said like five or six five, five or six, six months, months. She, she just got like christmas yeah it was and months would eat and get power back to after new year's and people back home only lost it for maybe two or three weeks that's just so crazy to us so we are blessed so blessed so but they did say that it, this is not a every year thing it's, yeah they don't get hit was, with one yeah she said it was but like, i would uh, imagine when it's bad when they do get hit with one bad. it's bad so yeah, wow. look at the, yeah you can see some of the where they ripped the, paneling the torn off. paneling i did get some footage on the way in on the taxi if you're wondering what that was you could kind of see i think we were supposed to go this way <laughs> i don't know you can kind of see how bad it was on the way here how things were still torn up i had no idea and i think they said hey there's our truck <laughs> look how good the windows tinted on the front look mm -hmm. we got to get our windows tinted <laughs> um they said st martin was also hit so i guess we'll get to see some of that tomorrow yeah but we're on the way down over here we have no idea where we're going and after this we're probably going to take a cab back because I'm sick of the rain and my feet hurt. because we haven't seen our boat for a long time. Yep. They put around. us... It's, it's been around the river bend. Mm -hmm. We um, docked at Crown Bay. We wish they would have docked us at Heaven Sites. Heaven Sets, however you pronounce it. That's where all the stuff was that we went. So we had to go forever away to even get to where everything was at. We're back though. We can stop and look at some of these stores. Where? Right here that we walked through. Oh, okay. See if they got in that um, spirit jersey. We are heading back to the boat. Cody thinks he is a photographer. I, for, I keep forgetting to take the cover off. This isn't his day job. <laughs> they need my license so the security get back on the boat they're really serious they're really serious they will not let you get back on the boat they got to check your license C -pass and, and your license. C pass card to make sure you're legit but as soon as I open my mouth I don't even have to show them my ID they're like no 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 go ahead you good you good you good we know you ain't from here <laughs> we're going right here because your girl's got wait, to pee. wait 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 where's the food we made it back to the cruise ship I think Cody's sunburn is finally getting to him. So we are off to, why are you making all these noises? We're going to find, there we go. We're going to find food. 
We are going to find lunch because it is almost four o'clock. I told you that when we walked on the boat. So I don't know how easy it's gonna be to find food because we haven't eaten since this morning, but. We've been walking trying to find Oh. When that first one sounded, I thought Cody was going to come out of that chair. <laughs> we seen two rainbows, which I probably should have got vlog footage of that. The rainbows. But I did get pictures of the rainbows. Uh -huh. I'll show a picture of the rainbows. We are in the solarium. I'm drinking. Crack coffee. Give it some energy. Are you happy to sleep? Your <laughs> face from the camera. Turn the camera to you. Are you sleepy? Dinner is at eight per use. So it's what six o'clock. Boat feels We're like moving. it's moving. Oh snap! Moving. Oh snap! If you ain't on the boat, you ain't getting on the boat. Oh my gosh, we are moving. Maybe you will get to see the boat move. We should have been up here. Well, I wanted to be in a round chair. I didn't want to be. Could have seen everything. My damn page. That's what our waiter at dinner calls me. Madame Page. I think Cody gets a little jealous over it. He'll say, he'll say, say, why does he ask you all the questions? Well, he does. He tells me everything. It's like, it's like Cody is not even sitting there. <laughs> oh, gosh. And then today I had, um, Getting on the boat, one of the man, the men like um, that was scanning our stuff in asked me. He said, "Don't you work here or on the boat?" And I was like, "No." He said, "I thought you worked on the boat." And I'm thinking, I ain't seen nobody that looked like me on this boat. I don't know what he was thinking, unless he was just trying to spark a conversation. Okay. We are moving. I don't think you can really tell, but. Maybe you can. We are moving. So we were all the way, you see the water? That's right there. We were all the way over to that a while ago. And now we're pulling, they're pulling us out. How are they gonna get this big thing out of here? I will never understand how they do this. They either got tugboats or they got motors. Specifically for Cause I'm, look, I'm watching the, the water churn out. Here. It ain't focusing. Oh, all right, now. Here. <laughs> Are you ready? Are you ready? Putting my shoes on. I need to tighten up my straps. We're getting ready to go to dinner. And then I think Cody wants to go to the gym afterwards. After I spent all this time curling my hair, really. Um, but if I go out into the wind, my hair will be no more. The curls really stop. The curls will be gone. Well, I mean, they'll still be there, but it'll just be large and in charge. So, um, yeah. I think I'm ready. I need to tighten these. So my, so our waiter, what is his name? Harry. Harry. So our waiter, Harry, doesn't get an eyeful. Because when they come to the table, they come behind you to serve over you. So, you know, he could just see all the cleavage that he could wa ever want in his life. Um, <laughs> all right. Will you quit that? <laughs> ready? Are you ready? Yeah, I think so. This is about as good as it's going to get. I can't do it with the camera shaking. Give me. 
Here's a look at the menu tonight. So I always get shrimp cocktail. Always, always get shrimp cocktail. But tonight I think I'm gonna do shrimp cocktail and this roasted poblano pepper soup. And I don't know about this yet. I think I'm gonna do fish of the day. He's gonna do fish of the day. I might do the roasted chicken breast. And then for my dessert, warm dark chocolate cookie. What are you getting? I might do the royal cheesecake. What about apple pie a la mode? It comes with vanilla ice cream. Oh, okay. Yeah, we kind of we ate some cheesecake today on that plate. Here's my first appetizer, poblano soup. It's green. Cody got the fruit medley as his appetizer. Well, Jesus. My entree made it to the table. I got the chicken breast, and it's kind of spicy smelling. Enjoy your dinner. I just want to give you some information you guys about tomorrow. Tomorrow we're gonna arrive at 8 o'clock. 8.30 the captain is gonna make the clearance in order to go out. Okay. 4.30 we need to be back on board. 5 o'clock we're gonna sell. So 8.30 to 4.30 we're gonna stay in San Martin. Okay. okay. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Let's see that. What did you get? Fish of the day? Fish of the day. He said it was uh, grout. It was what? Grout. Maybe I didn't know you. <laughs> Um, what did you say it was? <laughs> I knew until you said that. It started with an S. You can ask him, but it's definitely not grout. That's what you put town with towel. <laughs> <laughs> Here's my dessert. And I must say, y'all, it's banging. It is. It's, it's, it's so good. Cody's upset now. I know. I, I can see what is it. it called? The warm chocolate cookie or something. He got apple pie a la mode. But his favorite thing in the world is the cookie from Chili's. And this what this tastes like. It's good. I told you. Y'all, my mind is officially blown. Now, we were walking through the promenade. Promenade, promenade, the promenade. And I seen this woman with a dog, a little chihuahua. Somebody tell me. It was not fake either. It wasn't fake, it was a real dog. How did she get that dog on this boat? I have so many questions. Where she, how did the dog get on the boat? Where does the dog go potty? She was just sitting there at a, outside of the cafe promenade. My mind is officially blown. If she was an emotional support dog, my dogs support me emotionally. I need to get them. I need them. She probably got a lot of money in training to get the certifications for her. I'll do that. <laughs> if I can take Rosie and Lady everywhere, everywhere, I'm totally all over that. I was, that just shocked the crap there's, out of me. Cody and me and Cody like literally stopped in our tracks and I looked at him and I said, There's a dog. You don't know she probably she's probably experienced a very bad situation. You don't know. I've and, experienced and them dog, too. I've experienced him. I'm experiencing one now. Really? Yes. I need emotional support. <laughs> Good thing I'm gonna get around some, some Wi Fi tomorrow. I'm gonna FaceTime my dogs. I miss them so so much. What are you what are you doing? You see how glistening my eyes are? <laughs> I you miss like them. I miss them. I told him next vacation we went on the dogs were going. I don't know where we're going, but I want them to go. Somewhere just dog friendly. Dog friendly. I want them to go. I want them to experience life away from, home? away from home not that they will care <laughs> are you serious right now hey, I told you I had to but if you've ever been on a boat and you've seen a dog or you've taken a dog how how answer these questions for me how does the dog go potty where how does, does it go potty? Maybe a potty the same way it does at home where where does it go potty is the question you well, I know how it potties. I mean, but where? Where do they dispose of the pottyingness? Probably in the toilet. That dog might be trained to use the toilet. That dog would fall in that toilet. No. Dang it. 
don't understand. Jinx, don't make the fall. Jinx, Jinx again. That was a cat. I am just so mind blown right now. I can't get over it. I think we're going to get changed and go to the gym now. Even though what, I'm full as a teak. We got to see. My hair really does look kind of good. Of course, I'm about to go ruin it. We'll probably need to, um, but I'm going to set a little minute. Set a little, little minute. So I'm going to do some stretches and stuff in the gym. Where's That's the my plan. Schedule? Somewhere over there on my nightstand. Um, I'm going to go do some stretches and some back extensions and leg extensions. Just back to stretch. Yes, just to stretch my limbs. Limbs. My limity limbs. I'm going to stretch them out because I haven't done that. I haven't been able to stick to my three week workout plan because I didn't have Wi-Fi and I didn't think this through. But I think I've already talked about that. I can't remember, my days are running into each other. So I'm gonna have to start week three, Monday when I get home. Which I'm kinda, have, I'm kinda excited about it, starting it back because I like the routine it had been going in, but I'm upset because I was hoping to start a new workout plan on Monday and be completed with this one this week. but. The way the app set up, you gotta have Wi-Fi to download the new exercises. They don't unlock themselves until the day of, so you can't skip ahead and change things up. You have to do the exact thing. So because I didn't have Wi-Fi, because we didn't pay for the internet package, which kind of come in handy because it just help, it just it forces you to take a break from social media and from everybody else and just focus on each other and really get some relaxation in. So that's what we just, that's just our personal preference when we go on a cruise. And I haven't felt the urge to like want to pick up my phone and check anything. It's just really nice. 6 to 1 a.m. Oh, so we got time. Oh, yeah, we got So, um, I'm just tripping on how good my hair looks. Are you getting me now? Hi. Hi. <laughs> so we are going to the gym, ruining all of my pretty hair because I really thought it was actually looked really good. Of course, when I don't want it to look good, that's when it looks good. I'm gonna show you some of the stretches and workouts we do, depending on how many people are in the gym. If it's packed when we get in there, 